I know you are all dying to know. So just ask. Sasha, how do you stay so humble when you have over one million subscribers on YouTube? And I will share my tips with you today. Obviously in the style of Shane Dawson, when he unboxed his diamond play button, because like he was one of my inspirations back in 2013, along with Jenna Marbles. Thank you, Jenna. Thank you, Shane, for inspiring me. Back to the show! Excuse me, sorry. So, why am I so humble? Well, after giving childbirth by C-section, I had just awoken from my drugged state, and the nurse entered my hospital room and said to me, Permisi, kamu itu bule yang diwarwiri dulu sama komeng ga? And I said, yes. And then she proceeded to ask for a selfie. I looked like absolute shit, but because I am humble, I of course said yes. And after the selfie, she proceeded to show me a very large pill and said to me, Sekarang saya masukin ini ke anus kamu ya. And then I dropped my drawers and got a big surprise in the back door. That kept me humble. About two four nights ago, although I don't know what a four night is, I woke up at around 3 a.m. to find my entire backside was soaking wet because my daughter peed all over me. And that kept me humble. Every time I post a picture or a video of my mother, my haters say that my mother is prettier than me. And every time I post a picture of my daughter, the haters say that my daughter is prettier than me. And being the ugly one is very humbling. Sometimes memories keep me humble. For example, the big flood of 2000 something rather, when I had a room of Petak, and the water in my room of Petak was yay high, I say yay high, and I decided to go back to collect my toiletries. And when I reached the door of my room of Petak, it was covered in cockroaches. But I entered anyway, and as I made my way to the back of my room of Petak, the cockroaches swimming on the top of the flood waters were crawling up my shirt and all over my entire upper body. But I decided that I was not going to waste those toiletries. They were more important. And I also had one of those fluffy things in there, the one that you use to scrub to save soap. And I collected them. And I went back to my neighbor's house up the hill, smelling like cockroach. It's a good thing I got my toiletries. That memory keeps me humble. Even though I have a gold plaque with one million subscribers. Oh, it's so heavy. My own husband does not smile at me, nor does he laugh at any of my jokes. And he doesn't understand why any of you all follow me on YouTube. That keeps me humble. Several times a year, I get haters who say, Lu ngomongin Indonesia tapi lu cari makan di negara gua. And comments like those keep me humble because they imply that no matter how much value I produce with my work, I do not deserve to eat and therefore starve to death. Humble.
rule the house. I can even see myself in the reflection. <laughs> Sometimes, my dog goes out for a poo and the poo gets stuck on his bum hair and then it dries and then I have to get a tissue and kind of grab it and pull it off and he doesn't like it and I don't like it especially when the tissue tears because the poop is too hard and then the poop touches my hand hand, hand that experience humbles me that's why I'm so wonderful This gimbal humbles me. Oh my god. <laughs> Ugh. Wig snatched. This hair is humbling. So is this sweat mustache. Oh my god. Bali. Gila apanas banget, man. Okay, I put the wig back on. This is too humbling. Where's my gold play button? Seriously though, guys, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Pas buka YouTube channel, I had no idea that Indonesians were gonna like it. Karena uh, sebelum itu, gue udah coba gitu hiburin orang Indonesia, uh, dan kayaknya gagal terus gitu. Karena gue nggak kayak Sule kan. Sule is really good at entertaining Indonesians. Me, not so much. Uh, so, oh, I was so excited when you guys uh, started subscribing to my YouTube channel and it changed my life. Yeah, thank you, Indonesia. Thanks. Thanks to all of my subscribers. Thanks to Jason Daniels, who was the first person to tell me to start a YouTube channel. Even though, waktu itu kan 2009, 2010 gitu, um, YouTube bukan seperti sekarang ini. But yeah, and uh, thank you to um, all the people that inspired me. A lot of you did inspire me. Uh, like I was watching YouTube back in the Happy Holiday Indonesia days. And I was like, how did they get a million views? This is incredible. I want to be a YouTuber too, Gitulo. Um, you know, and when Mal Malam Minggu Miko came out, uh, I remember seeing it and laughing and, and thinking, I love this comedy and this means Indonesia is ready and YouTube is going to blow up and uh, it certainly did. Uh, and now I have a job on YouTube. This is incredible. And uh, thank you to myself too because I could have given up at a, a few points in my life, but I didn't. So thank you old Sasha for not giving up. Um, and happy holidays uh merry christmas if you celebrate if you celebrate christmas and uh happy new years and i love you all and thank you so much thank you so so freaking much and don't worry about me because i will always be humble anyway i'm obviously copying shane dawson but i'm a youtuber and that's what we do Copy others, okay? It's a sign of admiration. It's a compliment. Oh yeah, and these um these armpit stains after wearing this jacket for like 20 minutes. Woo! They'll keep you humble. Oh what's that there? Is that my oh that's my YouTube plaque for one million subscribers. How did that get there? <laughs>